Welcome back to Hot Dog, everyone. It's been a while for me and Brandon. We haven't, you haven't seen our faces on here for a while. It's been, I don't know, about a month maybe. MED has took, taken over for us and done the announcements and everything else needed. But we're back for this last month and we're going this last month strong. So. <laughs> And these are the announcements for today. Happy Spring Fling Week. Remaining dress up days include Thursday, which is Pick a Decade Day, Friday is Orange and Black. Prom is this Saturday. Make sure you've got your tickets and any other business that you need to take care of. The Key Club 4th Hour Pennies for Patience Drive ends this Friday. Make sure you get your coins in your 4th Hour bucket and get your sabotaging of other classes done as well. The Thunderhawk Award Ceremony is tonight at 7 p.m. at the Rice Center. Students receiving academic awards will have received an invite in the mail. Congratulations to all those students. The Scholarship Awards Ceremony will be in two weeks on May 18th at 7 p.m. in the Bright. Students will have received an invite to the Scholarship Awards cer Ceremony as well. Congratulations on making it to the month of May. Be sure to take all steps necessary to end the school year successfully. And that will be all for announcements. Mr. Van Drunen here. Just a couple things to share before we share a video from the Zen Zen about prom this Saturday. Uh, first of all, the McCrosty Arts Center, uh, they shared some information with me about some things coming up to think about. First of all, throughout the summer, uh, locally here in Grand Rapids, we have the First Friday Art Walk. So the first Friday every month uh, down at the Old Central School, businesses sponsor, you know, musicians, local artists, food trucks, there's usually uh, live music. So this is just kind of a fun community event. It's free to the public, and if you want a little heads up on what's going on on a particular Friday, you can go to grandrapidsarts.org and take a look at what might be coming your way. First one of the year is May 6th, this Friday. Also, the McCrosty Arts Center has an open pottery class on Tuesdays. It's kind of just a drop-in thing, $10. Um, they also have other classes, but if that's something you kind of would be interested in checking out, you can always go to their website. That's www.mccrostyartcenter.org. Hey everyone, this is your final reminder about all things prom. So prom is this Saturday, believe it or not, this Saturday. And these are just a few reminders and a little bit of more, little bit more information. There is an update, post prom is still free for those who are attending prom. It's included in your ticket that you've already purchased. So that is free to you, but if you are not going to the dance, if you are not going to prom, but you choose to go to post-prom, which I highly encourage, it is $10. It is $10, not $5 for post-prom. Uh, you get free, well, you get food included with that. Uh, I know there's going to be uh, the teas there that everyone loves uh, and a lot of different prizes um, that go along with that. BioBuild is expected to have a one drink per student there, which is pretty cool. You can check out Grand Rapids High School's post prom on Instagram for more information and all the prizes that they're posting about at GRHS post prom. Details of the day, 6 p.m. There are uh, professional photos being taken at the Rife Center if you choose to take part. You can pick up a form while buying your tickets at lunch, uh, but Three Months Sun will be there, be at the Rife Center at 6 p.m. Grand March begins at 7 p.m. There's no end time to that. It just is when the last person walks, and that is at the Rife Center. Everyone who's going to prom is welcome to take part in Grand March. Check out last week's video. If you don't know what Grand March is, there were a couple of videos from previous years. 8 to 11.30 p.m. is the dance. That is going to be held at the arena. And then 11 to 3 o'clock a.m. 
is post prom at the arena. Once again, free to those who are attending prom and $10 to those who are not going to prom. And all students grades nine through 12 can go to post prom. If you need a dress, I still have plenty of them. If um, you are in need of one, please come to Mrs. Enzen's room on the third floor. And just two final reminders. Today is the last day to turn in signed guest forms. Today is the last day. So those of you who have purchased tickets and you are bringing a guest but you have not turned in a form, you are not going to be able to bring that person if you do not get that form turned in today. So get that to the office. And then tomorrow is the last day to buy tickets during lunches. So that's really important. We are not selling tickets on Friday as we will be preparing for Grand March and we will not be at the lunches. If you have any questions at all, please feel free to contact me, Mrs. Enzen or Mrs. Falassi. And we hope that everyone is looking forward to this really fun day.